I don't know if you all experienced this, but something that I've been experiencing today that has been this block that I've really been feeling the desire to clear and to dissolve and unravel is this judgment of myself by myself and also the judgment that I perceive others are going to cast upon me if I somehow say the wrong thing or don't show up in a way that is agreeable or desirable. And it's interesting to, for me to watch in myself how I can be honoring this very pure calling to express myself and then I can so easily just dampen that with my own filters, these mental filters which say it matters that you say the perfect thing right now or that you provide a ton of value and really it's like I'm somehow mentally turning it into there's some means to an end and this end is like everyone getting so much value from the things I'm making which would be nice. I mean I would love it if people get value from my creation but I'm finding that it would be a lot more resonant for me to just honor the creative process and let myself be a natural expression of that which wants to come through and not judge it so much, not worry so much about what other people are going to think as if the things I share are trying to create some result. I just, I want to be process oriented and not result oriented so that I can be a pure channel of the energies that want to come through and not constantly clouded up with needing to get something from that. So, yeah, that's been Lemon Time number, <laughs> no, that's, that's the name of the Instagram vlog. This is Day in the Light 5. Or maybe this could be realization sharing, I don't know. I'm gonna probably just call it Day in the Light 5. Thoughts of a lemon. <laughs> All right. <laughs> On that note, thanks for listening, and I'll see you in the next one. If you don't follow me on Instagram, my tag is going to be in the description. It would be awesome if you follow me there. And I'll probably also put my SoundCloud up. I have one song up. It's called Oh Honey. You can check it out. I made it with my friend Cassidy. She's amazing. And yeah, I'm going to be making more of these vlog-like documenting my experiences of overcoming the struggles of internal authenticity. So wow, this would have been a much better backdrop for a video, huh? Whatever. See you in the next one. Peace. <laughs>